All right, so setting up the uh, Visium analyzer, um, this is the the, one, the component which analyzes your Visiums. Normal regular characters that have got mouth shapes would use this to drive blend shapes, but if you just want to get the data, this is how you do it. Uh, this is an avatar, believe it or not, it's just a head and hands avatar. It's the most optimized one that I, I regularly use because uh, it's just a picture of my logo and that's it. Um, so up here uh, on the avatar's head, I'm going to go ahead and make a new child. Now on this child, we're going to add a bunch of components. Um, some of these you might already have and you can make use of. Uh, so do double check. You don't want to always, you don't want to be using duplicate components wherever you can. So go to media utility and then you're looking for Visium Analyzer. With Visium Analyzer added, um, you then want to see, uh, uh, where are we? Users, common avatar system, uh, audio, avatar voice source assigner. With that added, we can close this. Now, uh, Avatar Voice Source Assigner will assign a source property to your voice when you equip the avatar. So if I drop this into here, it means that when I equip this avatar, this source property here will be assigned to my voice, which will go up to here. So if I then equip this avatar and deselect all so I don't have a doobly doo in my face and then find the inspector again, uh, you'll see that we've now got those raw bits of data coming out there. And so you can then use these for whatever you want um, other than blend shapes. Now, the problem with laughter probability is that it's a probability. Um, so a zero means 0%. Zero There's a 0% chance that you're laughing. And 100 or 1 means that there is a 100% chance that you're laughing. Um, it's not that good. Uh, Fruix and I have taken a look at it, and it's just it's not that good. Um, so do keep that in mind. But there you go. There's how to get that laugh value sorted. <laughs>